Now, forewarn weather with Exact Track 4D radar. Exclusive technology for the most up to the minute weather information in your neighborhood. Okay. okay. What's your idea? Carry on. Oh, right. Yeah, so I've yeah. done this with my kids and they're all frustrated because they're like, you know, I need 17 yeah. swimsuits. Too bad. Too so bad. it's just check bags. You can uh -huh. still, because yeah. some airlines you can't, you have to pay even for a carry on. That bag. is true, but right now that's not right. the case. I mean, for so Delta. So if you see me with a week's worth of clothes like on. Right. Well, do you do that when you go <laughs> no, on? Because no, I, I put on my work, I put on my workout clothes and I carry my gym shoes and I like, I look like I, you do. Like, yeah. I don't have a no, place to stay. No, I'm living in my put backpack. Stuff in my suitcase. Exactly. But it's that's another awesome way to do it. Yeah. You and I vibe the same. Yeah, we, we usually do. If there's a way around it, we're going to find it. That's another story. Yes, it is. You and I. I need to do like a podcast or something. <laughs> Cloudy skies out there right now. The sun is trying to get through the clouds, but just not being successful. Winds are still out of the north northeast, so there's an added little chill in the air, but it's not too bad. I mean, this is about where we should be for this time of year, a little bit above downtown at 46, 48 in Monroe, but around average for Howell and Lapeer in the low 40s. Exact track 40 radar. It looks like it's about to rain, but it's not. It's dry out there right now. No returns on the radar, but there are a lot of clouds here, but you can see the clearing line. It's very distinctive. I mean, out of the entire state, we're the only ones that that is experiencing a cloudy day. It's sunny in Grand Rapids, sunny in Traverse City, and sunny over in Alpena, but we just have to get through this clearing line. As it moves to the east, we might get a little late day sunshine right before the sun sets, which is around 630 today, but uh, not much. 44 degrees in Mount Clemens, only in the upper 30s in Port Huron. Those, those clouds are really making it tough for the temps to climb there. 45 in Ann Arbor, 42 in Howell, I suspect. By 5 o'clock tonight, what time is it, 4.17? Yeah, by 5 o'clock tonight, places like Lansing and on the west side that are going to get a little sunshine, that temp might pop up into the uh, upper 50s, maybe or upper 40s, maybe even touching 50 degrees. 59 in St. Louis, 61 in Kansas City, but the cold air goes down to Columbus where it's only 48, 60 in Pittsburgh, and checking in on the east coast, 43 in Boston, and 50 in New York City. Tomorrow morning, there'll be some clouds, but we'll also get more sunshine tomorrow than what we had today. And certainly by the afternoon and evening, we're just going to call it partly cloudy. It won't be a, you know, completely mostly sunny day. There will be some clouds, but at least more sun than what we had today. And then Friday, we cloud right back up again at ahead of our next system, which comes in Friday evening and lasts until Saturday. Countdown is on 13 days until spring. And sure sign of spring is that we spring forward at 2 a.m. on uh, Saturday night and into Sunday. So your forecast for tonight, 37, mostly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, a little more sun than what we had today, and that'll get our temps into the upper 40s, close to 50 degrees. And it gets warmer next week, but it'll be a quick cool down this weekend. Sunday's the coldest day of the week with a high of only 41, and that overnight low will only be in the 30s. So we'll talk more about the chill for next week and then the warm-up after that coming up tonight at 5. All right. Thank you, Kim.